Hi everyone, it's Miss Akvari in the library. I want to tell you about a new book that we got in. It's called The Best At It, and it's by author Malik Pancholi. Um, this book is in our teen and teen issue section, and the main character is going through a lot of um, issues kind of all at once. Um, the main character in this book, his name is Rahul. Um, Rahul lives with his family, including his grandfather, in a small town in Indiana. And um, his father's a doctor, his mother owns her own company, um, and Rahul is the oldest in his family. He has a younger brother, and Rahul has a great best friend. Her name is Chelsea, um, but Rahul is really struggling a little bit. He's nervous about going back to school, specifically because he's starting junior high this year, and there's one kid in particular who picks on him a lot and bothers him all the time um, and kind of bullies him. Um, and that kid's name is Brent, and Brent lives in his neighborhood. And so Rahul, as he's sort of struggling with this and trying to figure out about getting back to school and how he should handle this transition of getting into junior high, his grandfather, Bai, tells him that the like one real good strategy is to find the thing that you're good at and try to be the best at it. And Rahul really takes that language to heart. And so he spends a good chunk of his year like trying out different things and trying to see if that's something that he's going to like. Um, and across the way, it's kind of funny some of the stuff that he tries out and how it goes for him. Um, Rahul also struggles with a little bit of um, some compulsive thoughts at times. And so that's kind of interesting to read about and to kind of try to understand what that might be like because that impacts his behavior out as well. This book was really enjoyable for me to read. I um, kind of could sympathize with Rahul's struggles in starting kind of that next section in your life. Starting junior high is kind of a big deal. Um, I liked how he was trying out different things. He he always kind of had ideas about what to do next. So he wasn't just sitting back and letting problems wash over him. He was kind of trying to take some action, which I thought was great. And there's a lot of really funny, heartwarming, um, real life kinds of things that you'll read um, as you read the best at it.